Here we have a 3D laser scan that was made with a Leica Scan Station C10. The data set is about 50 gigabytes and we're looking at it here on the screen. We can look all around and of course we can look inside because there are exterior scan interior scans as well. Change the settings so we can see a little better here. And it's almost like being there. With the added advantage, you can float through floors and doors and walls. I'm just navigating using the mouse buttons. Here is the same data set brought into Revit 2014. What can we do with it there? Of course we can look around. Not quite as easily as in Recap, but of course we have the tools that Revit offers such as 2D views, sections, three-dimensional sections. Recap has three-dimensional sections as well. Let's look at it in plan. And here we have already traced Revit elements over our scans. came out like that. Tracing of Revit elements is subject to the interpretation and skills of the user of Revit. Also one wants to determine what is an appropriate level of detail. To model in. You can also look in any view and see the point clouds along with whatever walls, floors, doors, windows, families, etc. that you've put in. The objective survey is the point cloud and whatever you do in Revit is the subjective interpretation of existing conditions.